Hello guys, today we're back and we're about to create a Minecraft mod. I just need a name for this. How about the Glitchy Experience? Totally not a reference to the Greg mod, which is called the Diffy Experience, made by Diffy MC. Shout out to that guy, even though he's like way bigger of a channel than me. His, his works are still cool. So let us create the, the Glitchy Experience. And this, this will be the greatest mod ever. You see, currently it's setting up project files, setting, setting up stuff like that. Yeah. I don't know how to explain it, but you know what? Who cares? So how is this mod's gonna work? I have a plan. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it, I'm just gonna make the most stupid stuff possible. Like, for example, when you're holding a furnace, you can god bridge with waxed weathered cut copper stairs. Imagine you're just playing Bed Wars, and then you see someone god bridge with waxed weathered cut copper stairs at the speed of sound. Doesn't that sound pleasant? Well, that's what you're getting out of the glitchy experience once I figure out how to actually make a mod. And as you may have seen early- ooh. Ooh. Juicy numbers. 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 Data. We. It's it's the numbers. Me like numbers. Good number. Like number. As I was saying, so that's that's what you're getting out of the out of the glitchy experience. The most stupid stuff I can think of. Except it's actually going to, it's actually going to work. All right, we're finally here. So the first thing I'm going to add is a new item, once I can find that item. The, the name of the item. Inventory Scaffold. That's what I'm, that's what I'm calling this. The item texture is going to be, uh... Let's create a texture. And it's... Uh, Let's let's pick a template for this. What template should we use, guys? What, what is that? A single bubble? Guys, okay, stop clicking on stuff. I'm trying to click on the spider. So, we're trying- we're just going to pick one of these and then change it in our own way. I think I am going to pick this funny little face and click create. Let's make it purple. And then let's- we'll just cover this up with purple. Actually, actually, better idea. We'll give them tiers. We'll have white for common. The common one's gonna be white. Uncommon can be... The uncommon one we have is gonna be green. And we're gonna have a rare, we're gonna have an epic, and we're gonna have a legendary. Or maybe the last two can be legendary and mythic? I'm not sure. I just want purple to be the last one, and... Mythic sounds like purple, so I think I think we're gonna go common, uncommon, rare, legendary, mythic. So so we'll save that as an item. Common ab common ability. And then we'll we'll slap that onto this thing. Common ability. Inventory scaff. Parity, common. Creative inventory tab. We'll fix that later. One, zero. Hmm. 
She might get immune to fire because it's an ability. Stay in crafting grid when crafted. And no, because we're not going to use it to craft anything. This is like when you when you use a a bucket in your crafting recipe, or just repair something. Or no, not like repairing it. Damage item instead on craft. No. Hmm. So effectively, this thing is going to be useless, with the exception of something else, actually. We'll save mod element for now. And then, what? first of all, we're going to add a creative tab, for which is just going to be a tab in creative mode for all of all of the items. Okay, so it can't have spaces, so I'll just remove that. And then, tab icon. We'll let that face there. Save element. Go back to inventory scaffold. Properties. The glitchy experience. Creative tab. Alright, now let's make a procedure, which is pretty much just a, a thing that will happen. Yeah, it's a thing that will happen. I'll explain later. Uh, scaffold ability. World. Let's see. Scaffold ability procedure. Triggered by external. So we're looking for something that places a block or slash set block. Execute command. Math. Logic? Where's, uh, where's minus? Oh, there it is. And then also in math, we have this. This is my first time making one of these, so execute command set actually, actually we, we can literally just do that and then Change the commit. How do I pick this up? There, you're gone. Negative one. And then we'll set... Not that. We'll go back to inventory scaffold. Advanced... Per, uh, no, triggers. When item in hand, tick. Scaffold ability procedure. Okay, so we'll set it so when this item's in your hand, it it works. So now we're going to file or no? How do I save? You know what? I'll just I'll just test it. I'm pretty sure it auto saves. It's loading. It's loading. This is a good sign. Yeah. 
It, we are loading the glitchy experience for the first time. Oh yeah, we have no we have no crafting recipe for inventory scaffold yet. So this is gonna be, yeah. We're just gonna we're just gonna pull it out and create it, and test it. And this is gonna be this is gonna be pretty cool if this works. Waiting for it to load, waiting for it to, Ooh, what's this? A live subscriber count in the top right corner. You should sub. Like right now. Watch that number go up. If it doesn't go up, don't worry. That's because this whole thing is pre-recorded. Because this isn't a live stream clip. This is a video. A normal video. So that thing in the top right won't go up the mo won't go up on this recording whenever you subscribe, but next time I record, it'll work. All right, I'm in with a default skin, and I'm dead because that's how this works. We go into yes Minecraft. I know how to I know how to play. If I go into here, there's more. There's more tabs than usual. Usually there's just these tabs, these tabs, and these tabs. Now we have a second page, and guess what? The glitchy experience is here. Inventory scaffold. It works. It works, I have inventory scaffold. And when it's not in my hand... I can do- I can do stuff like that. So far, this thing is working brilliantly. Yeah, I can bridge. Holy... That was a straight string of blocks. Yeah, this is working. We have a trail of cobblestone. So that has worked out brilliantly. So now what we're going to do, we're going to make a few changes. First of all, we're going to make the, uh, we're going to make a crafting recipe for this thing. So, recipe. INV scaffold. Recipe. Create. And on this end, we put the inventory scaffold in. Now, we just need to design a recipe. Let's, uh, let's make it a diamond block and cover it in cobblestone. Shall we? Actually, any stone. I don't want to, I don't want to be painful to anyone that wants to, to anyone that wants to get this. Because any stone ranges from cobblestone to granite to andesite. Diamond block covered in stone. That is how that works. So now, let's add a mob. Or actually, better yet, actually, never mind, let's just add a mob. What should we call this mob? Bob.
Let's let's choose a let's choose a model. Let's pick something annoying, shall we? Uh silverfish. In pictures, what should we you you know what? Nothing. This is the most dumb thing I have. Nothing. Nothing to hit. Hmm. Let's let's make it uh let's make it red and cyan. I don't I don't know. That's phonic. So now let's uh do a boss bar. Should we do a boss bar? No. Bop. Oh. Let's pick a let's pick a sound. What would, what would be more annoying than the sound of a mule? A, a sound of a mule when they get hurt. That sounds, that sounds decently annoying, right? Now, behavior. Hmm. Mm hmm. Block they drop when they die. Initial and maximal base health of a mob. Two is one heart. You know what? Let's make it. Let's make it have the helpful player. Actually, health of a player times one point five, which means fifteen hearts. I want to experience earned from killing a buff. Let's let's give it. A, let's let's give it fifteen. That sounds about right. Uh, zero point five. That sounds about right. Actually, actually, just one. Let's set those extremely high. And so this time, last time, this was four times higher than this. So let's uh, 
Let's sit. There. Attack strength. Ooh, let's make it, let's make it, um, five hearts. That should be good. Out of built-in armor points. Well, maximum gives you 80%, so... And you know what, that, that works. Attack knockback. Knockback resistant. Uh, 0 0.5, sure. Yep. Hmm. Immune to? Immune? We, to, we can make it immune to stuff. Let's make it... Let's make it immune to a lot of things. Everything except these three should work. And now let's let's change a few more things. Inventory, uh, no. Triggers. When it is struck by. We'll we'll mess with this in a bit. It's AI and both. Hmm. This is all actually decently tricky to figure out. Although, wait, we can, we can make it follow certain things. Ooh. Watch the closest entity of type. Can we set it to players? Hmm.
let's uh, let's try out this little entity AI. First, first of all, uh, let's let's put move his spawn egg into the glitchy experience category. And let's wait for it to compile. You wait for, because the but the button's behind my sub count. Now we're waiting for this to load. This is the start of the best the best mod I've ever thing. The best mod I've ever thing. I I already have a good idea for the thumbnail. I'm gonna Actually I'm just kidding. I already made the thumbnail like five minutes before I started recording. It didn't take that long. All you need is Adobe Express and some good source footage. We go back into this world. Back into full screen. Yes, I know the screen just went black. I'm just going into full screen. Hey. That's better. And now we're back. Bob. Oh god. He's a bit slow. Although he's annoying enough to hit, which is great. Yeah, try and get me up here, idiots. Okay, so there are a few features I want to add to this, Bob. First of all, let's add a, another procedure. Actually, no, no, actually, no. Block. Bob block. Import texture, nothing. Nothing. Properties. Which is material. Anvil. Anvil is a material. Now let's set hardness to three. Sure. Hmm. Okay, yeah, it's just it's just simple things. Has gravity. Advanced pro- Ooh, wait, hold on. I can make a sound play when the block is broken. This is gonna be the most painful- the most painful thing. Because whenever anything happens to the block, even when you build build death sound, a 
Okay, now, new procedure. Entity action. This I need distance to my total distance. Unless You know what? Nah, I don't. I don't need. To. I was gonna make it so it's gonna. It's just gonna god bridge. But if it gets too close to you, it'll stop god bridging, so it can actually hit you, just like what Greg does in Diffie Experience. But eh, the more scuffed a mod is, the better. So we're just gonna completely skip that. Block block procedures actions. Not command. Ball block. And we're going to do some simple math. On entity tick update, Bob Scaffold. Now it's compiling, it's compiling, this is gonna be beautiful. Run client. It, we're going to run this once again. It's loading once again. Ah. <laughs> Wait, three mobs loaded. Okay, I'm just gonna guess that's, uh, I'm just gonna guess that's... Yes, Minecraft, a mod. Forge, and also a mod. The glitchy experience. This time, an actual mod. So let's open up the glitchy experience world once more, and this time, this time things are gonna be cool. Oh god. Oh. It, 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 I gave it a way up. I mean, the kind of on purpose, but okay. Yeah, 
yet AI isn't the smartest for what it for its capabilities. It would be smarter on the ground because it just chases you where it can go, but it doesn't know it can just bridge over to me and do that. So that's something to fix. For now, we're going to make this world really cool. Bob world. Bob biome. Uh, the Bob biome. Climate downfall pop. Possibility of raining. Zero. So it would save me. Air color. And let's let's make it red. Grass color. Blue. Foliage. Okay. okay, leaves. And green works. Actually, yeah. Water color. And uh, purple. Purple. Water fog color. Cyan. No, this cyan. Great. The block on the top layer. So, grass. Where, where the hell's grass? Where the fuck's grass? There it is. Dirt. Bob blocks. Actually, actually, we'll just make all the, all everything underneath the grass. Bob blocks. Negative two, to two. Because it can be any temperature in Bobland. Negative two. Zero. Yeah, it looks about right. Let's that's buy it, let's generate it everywhere. Weirdness range. Sure. Hmm. Fossils. Yeah, we want fossils in the in the thing. Amethyst geodes. No, let's just make this place rich with random stuff. What's this I see? Lush Caves decoration. Sure. Uh, 
screen shape. Eh, I'm good. The stem should be should be Bob. The branch. Wait, branch. Control to block used for the leaves. Okay. So that should be leaves. This block should be void air. And then fruits. It should be void air. Structures. Yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes. Yeah, wait, what? Ocean moon. Okay. Yes. No villages. No. Entity spawning. Bob. You should mob mark this ambient will spawn under any conditions. Uh, but this category should be used for mobs with no gameplay effect. Uh, sure, the Bob has no gameplay effect. Yeah, sure. Let's just uh, let's just make him. Effects. Pig step will be played constantly in the pie. Great, this sounds great. Now I wait for that to start, and this will be a beautiful mod. The most beautiful anyone has ever seen. With all the dependencies of compiled classroom. Reading sync. Okay, it's green. Red. Red button behind the sub count. Right here. It's red. Spawning. Console. Creating thing. Let's look at numbers. It's numbers. It's number. Build successful. 
Oh, that means I can run this. Executing Gradle test, run plan, number. Where are the numbers? This is all letters. Well, that's still mostly letters. Mostly. There's a long string of the same letters. I like that. The same or similar letters. A pattern. We 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 we. We 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 we. OBS is saying encoding overloaded. Consider changing settings or. And now, we really changed the world. Let's go, guys. Wait, does this still work if I put it in my offhand? Ooh, it does. Our goal is to... Uh, never mind, I already found it. Eh. Actually, I should get myself some some decent gear. And let's let's give myself some basic diamond armor and other other stuff. Fun fact: diamond armor and netherite armor have the same the same. Uh, hold on, what was it again? Yeah, they have the same protection. But netherite just has more, more durability. Okay, I should probably stop that before I get copyrighted, but yeah, we found the mob dimension, or no, biome, and that's the most we'll change the world today. Goodbye, freaks. Subscribe if you liked the video.